What? Betrayer, holy shit. Hey guys, that's the thing here and welcome back to another episode of The Liberator. So we have already finished the main story and now we are going for the DLC. There are two parts of DLC here and let's see if I can finish them in one shot or not. Okay, let's go. I hope they they answer our question about the main story though. There are so many doubts there. Uh, honey, can you take the kids to school? I need to head into the office early. Mm hmm. Huh? What time is it? Uh, I'll have to phone work and tell them I'll be late, but it should be all right. You get going. Okay, this is someone else's life or someone else's perspective. An investigation is underway following the skyscraper attack that took place last week. Preparations for the funeral of Captain Frank Robbins, the hero of St. Martha's, who tragically died during the attack, are already underway. Okay. I guess this is what happened afterwards. Morning, Steve. Morning, Bob. How's Jen? We've all been missing her. She's fine. Settling into the new position. She definitely prefers the regular hours. <laughs> yeah, the graveyard shifts can be a real killer. Sure wish I could get a promotion like that. <sighs> I guess I need to get working on my KPIs first, though. You said it. Just gotta keep our noses to the grindstone, huh? What's going to happen in this DLC? I'm so curious. Let's see what we have. Do we have the... 23 GB files. <laughs> oh, Nash. Okay. All right, check profile. Check profile? Mm, seems clean. Verify IP address. Makes good money. And a family man. So why stir the pot, Georgie boy? Hmm? Interesting. No active warnings. Let's see what we missed. Nothing. Really? Okay. Just another scumbag. Ah. How's your day, honey? Who is this Please. guy? <laughs> Lots of new cases this week. I sent you an email about a guy I found. Take a look when you get a chance. I saw. It's already on my to-do list. Just phoned to let you know I might have to stay longer today. Remember to pick the kids up on time, okay? Just watch out, Michael's in one of his moods again. Where were we, George? Okay. Open. See what we find now. Confirm. Perform in-depth analysis. No ticket? Bad man. But not bad enough. Uh, wow. Confirm. This system. Oh my god. They really can check everything. No. Getting warmer. Jeez, what a boy scout. Lit tax return. Yeah, yeah. All right, now we're talking. Mm. 
Organize a fundraiser online illegally. Okay. Good riddance. Report to the police. Okay. <coughs> so he's considered as a bad guy now. Hi, honey. Looks like I'll have to stay longer at work after all. We're still organizing the funerals for the victims of last week's skyscraper attack. I'll okay, I let the kids know they're in for a treat. Oh, before I forget, I sent you some more information on that professor. Hope it helps. See you later. Final touch. What? <laughs> I'm still I'm still kinda confused what is going on here. You taking off? Yeah, I have to pick up the kids. See you tomorrow then. School? Okay, the math so boring. Maths so boring, huh? <laughs> it's actually quite fun if you know how to do it. <laughs> Mom, today at school we talked about work and what our parents do. What do you and Daddy do? We cut bad people, Angel. We stop them from hurting everyone else. Wow, so you're like superheroes. Cool. I want to do that when I grow up. No, 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 no. <laughs> you guys are invading people's privacy. <laughs> George Nash, open up, please. FBI, open up. <laughs> you know, the red, the meme. <laughs> Right there, scumbag. Stand back. What? He's an old man. So old already. Okay. What? <gasps> oh my god, I didn't expect expect the DLC to be so short. I mean like I I uh, at first I expect uh one DLC is about is about fifteen to thirty minutes to be able to tell us more about the main story. But let's go through the second part and see what's going on here. Come on. been doing a lot of overtime recently yeah it's been intense hopefully it'll quiet down again soon I just I just don't want anyone to think I'm not up to it you know hmm the minister will see you now minister it's an honor. Please accept our condolences. We were shocked when we heard about your son's death. That's very kind of you. These are trying times indeed, but we cannot let those animals get the better of us. So they are not now, thinking as of you well know, there explaining many what's going on in our struggle <laughs> for a safe and prosperous world. My son is only one in a long string of senseless murders. Unfortunately, I've brought you here today to discuss another tragic death. As it stands, Captain Frank Robin's state funeral is of utmost importance. 
He was a beacon of stability and integrity in a sea of chaos, a role model for all citizens. He fought night and day to stamp out the terrorist threat to our great nation. Frank, to put it simply, was a true hero. Now, his sacrifice must not be in vain. His spirit is needed more than ever before, and it is my intention that he is glorified and remembered by us all. Okay. Mm. This funeral of his needs to be a demonstration of unity. It is absolutely imperative that we rally the nation around him. I don't want any surprises, is that clear? Asking for your support and understanding in this matter. Of course. You can count on us, Minister. Uh, one more thing before you go. L let the authorities deal with Frank's files. He deserves to be remembered as a hero. Everyone has their weaknesses, but in this case it would be better for the future of this country if we let sleeping dogs lie. Of course, Minister. We understand the gravity of the situation. Good. And remember, glory to the heroes. Glory to the heroes. So... The DLC is just to... Tell us what's going on after that. Frank's profile has disappeared from the CCS, just as we expected. There's no interaction though. It wasn't going to be much use anyway. If you're interested, I'm almost finished editing the footage we got from the waterfront. Sure. Let's see if you're as good as you say. Of course I knew the government was behind St. Martha's. We all did. What was I supposed to do? The ministers are above the law. I don't have the power to stop them. Okay. So, what do you think? Convincing? Looks like you can keep bragging, Rick. Good job. What the hell's going on here? Mm -hmm. Mac is alive. Okay. I remember their conversation. He didn't say anything like that. Who the hell cares? He knew what was going on. He just didn't have the balls to admit it. Now he'll get a chance to tell the truth. Some simple video processing, a deep fake, and voila. Think about it, Meg. If they make Frank into some kind of martyr, this video will blow a hole in their bullshit. A deep fake. Wow. We can't just deserve to be remembered as a hero, Meg. You can change. Wow. I ever tell you about they my just niece added and Emily? Another age custom now. conversation. She was raped by some pumped up prick officers who had one too many beers. At first she kept it from us, but little by little it ate away at her. The confident young lady I knew slowly disappeared. When I confronted her about it, she broke down and told me everything. I was naive. I encouraged her to file a report to fight for justice and make sure they paid for what they did. Even when they laughed her out of the station, she managed to find the courage to file a lawsuit. But it was her word against theirs. But they were bulletproof. All thanks to Frank. Every power he'd ever exploited, every loophole he'd ever created, it all meant the police were beyond question. But that wasn't the end of it. I don't know how the fuck they did it, but they managed to make her out as the aggressor. Suddenly she was facing two counts of assaulting a police officer. Corruption breeds corruption. When they found out it was my niece, Frank stepped in. And just like that, they offered her a settlement. Emily jumped off the roof of her apartment block. She couldn't live with the disgrace. 
So I did what the courts couldn't. I sent those cowardly motherfuckers to an early grave. And I should have done the same to Frank. Politics, sir. It's all about politics. Meg, this team sacrificed too much to get this far. Don't go soft on us now. <sighs> okay, what's the plan? All right. So what's the plan? What's the plan? Don't end so fast. I don't know what's going to happen. Objective. Get to the broadcast room without being detected. Okay. At least we get to play a bit in this in this second DLC. The first DLC is just an introduction. Wow. Without getting Okay. The security system and some of the lights still have their own power supply. Okay. You'll only have a few minutes to sneak into the broadcast room. That's it. Good luck, Meg. Use the crowd as cover to get to the staff entrance. Mm. Objective. Get to the broadcast room without being detected. What do you mean without being detected? Okay, okay. <laughs> That's the case. There's so many people. Go away. Okay. Are we supposed to... Are we supposed to expose something here? I think so. Uh, does that mean I have to shoot? I think so. Oops. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh my god. Fine. Fine. I have to do this. Ah, uh, never mind. Just headshot. I don't have to waste time. All the headshots, then it'll be fine. Okay, puzzle solving time. Okay, this one is like this. Okay, should be this. Mm. Mm, okay, okay. This one going down. Okay. Good here. This one should be like this. Ooh, I'm a hacker. <laughs> There's an, an achievement for a hacker. What? What is going on? Use a gun to defend. Oh wow. Well. Just have to be fast. Shoot faster. Come on. Oh my god. Shoot the window. Let's go. Okay, go, 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 go. No? Not this way. The other way? No. <laughs> okay. There's no there's no indication. I mean like uh because Everything is so black, already so black. They, they expect us to know what to do in this 
dark situation. Can't really see what's down there. Alright. Jump again. No, 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 no. Okay, go up. Jump. Go up. Jump. And then climb up. There's another ladder. Right? Let's go. Time to escape. Okay, there's a drone. Ah, uh, another drone. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Damn. <laughs> it's still so hard to control. Ah. Uh. What? Ay, that is bullshit. I mean, I have to jump earlier because I scared they will eat up my spacebar. They, they eat up my spacebar a lot of times, you know. So stupid. <laughs> Run all the way to where? Wow, it's so long. What? What am I supposed to do? Jump down. Okay. Parachute. <laughs> I thought I was supposed to go up. Is this Mac? Run. Run? FBI. Oh shit. Oh man. Good afternoon. Them. Ah oh, shit, I That's click okay. away. <laughs> no rush. But sooner or later you'll want to talk. Is it the same officer again? No, this is see, dif Meg, different guy. You're never leaving this place. So get comfy. We've got all the time in the world. You must be curious about what happened after your little stunt with the video. Sorry to disappoint you, Meg. Nobody saw it. It never even left the building. But it gets better. We had someone watching you this entire time. What? Someone who wanted a chance to redeem himself. To leave the past behind and Double help build a brighter agent. future wow. for us all. Okay. I'd say he's earned it, wouldn't you? What? Betrayer! Holy shit! That's why I just said I got an achievement for the betrayer. It's really a betrayer. Okay. So that's it. That's it for that's it for the whole game. Uh the The reviews in Steam are quite meh, you know. It's mixed. Then now I understand why why people some of them don't like this game this is because they are actually not much interaction but neither the story is good just because they it's not complete you know it's not complete they leave us a lot of space to do the thinking but uh, it's all question mark. After I played the DLC, then I realized that it's something. 
it's all about politics la. like you will never you will never be able to win against the politics or uh, you can never trust anyone okay in the end the government will still win because they control the society right so what are you telling us that we cannot fight back we just had have to submit ourselves to the to whatever it is even though it means sacrificing our privacy and freedom something like this i think i think they are trying to convey this kind of message because it's all the bad ending you know at first in the main game yeah we the liberated got got a file uh dis distributed to all the citizens but in the end not 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 many people believe them and it kind of ended up uh in vain you know it's like government still wins and then in this dlc they are telling us that someone in the liberated betrayed their own member just just to live a happy life i don't know <laughs> what what would you what you what you think about it what would you think about it uh, but nonetheless i enjoy this kind of comic style but developers just help me out next time if you want to develop this kind of game comic style game make sure you have good interaction good storyline at least give us a good ending even if you want you want to give us a bad ending give us a proper ones don't give us a lot of question marks and cliffhanger okay <laughs> Alright, that's all for this game and I hope you guys enjoy it. There are lots of questions I know. I'm very confusing as well. So it is what it is what it is. <laughs> okay. I'll see you guys again in the next one. See ya.